This is the first car I've ever bought in my life. And Ellie, mommy's trying to do a voiceover. And sadly today, Ellie, sadly today we will be parting ways. So today we are picking up my brand new car that I ordered. We ended up customizing a car. Three months later, the car is finally in. So we're finally picking it up. My goal today is to pay the brand new car off in cash. So <gasps> me and Elijah looked at a lot of SUVs. This car, it had a special place in my heart. We looked at Range Rover really close to getting the Volkswagen Atlas Sport. I actually really liked that, but it was going to take six months to come in. So we ended up not doing that. We looked at the Cadillac Escalade, but it's just a, too big of a car. Elijah loved the Escalade, but it was just not really realistic for our lifestyle. We wanted an SUV with third row seating though. And the Escalade was a nice car, just too big. And it would not fit in our garage. We looked at the Toyota 4Runners. Wasn't really like crazy about it. I do love the fact that Toyota cars like last forever. My dad still has his truck that's like a 2011 truck and it's still like running. It's better than this car right here. My car that's a 2016. A lot of you guys actually did not guess the car when I told you guys to guess. So you guys are gonna be a little surprised. With the car, I ended up like adding a bunch of like packages in it. I will tell you guys everything that I upgraded my car to. I'm very grateful that I'm even able to do this, especially pay off my car instead of like finance it the interest rates right now is so bad so that's why my goal was to just pay it off I'm very sad to get rid of Manny the Mercedes my first ever car which I'm so grateful for that I was even able to get a car at that age I'm definitely gonna cry a little bit I'm gonna be a little sad because I have so many memories with this car like skipping school Shut up. Oh, we even brought Eliana home in this car. We left our wedding in this car. Like, we just have so many memories in it. This car, too, passed a lot of their safety inspections. That's what we were really looking for, was a really safe SUV. This car definitely checked off that list. Other than that, it's gonna be like a 40 minute drive, so I'll see you guys in 40 minutes. If you're watching this right now, comment below what car you think I got. are finally at Lincoln so if you guys couldn't tell I got the Lincoln Aviator Reserve and I got their 2023 models first of all the car has the luxury package which means that these seats massage you with the back seats you guys can see right here there's third row seating so this is the back of the car I had the option to keep this open put a console here or have another seat in here and I wanted it to be open these seats go up of course but there's a lot of trunk room space as you guys can tell I got light interior which I love the interior is in sandstone. This is touchscreen, I believe. So we have a sun visor just for Eliana. There's a lot of really cool features in here, which I'm not really a car person, so maybe Elijah can like do that for you guys. But just like the interior itself, it's gorgeous. With this car, I also got the jet black package. My car has like the black rims and then there's like black detailing, which I love. It's kind of similar to, what would you say this car is similar to? That Hyundai. Remember that Hyundai? We just finished signing all the papers to finalize everything. They gave me a little goodie bag. They gave me a goodie bag with champagne and glass bottles, gift certificate to a dinner. And these are my keys right here. Look at my keys. I also can control my car through my phone so we're actually trying to set that up right now and they're trying to help me do everything we're driving it home we're gonna go see if it fits in the garage now because we actually did not do that that was really quick we got there at five o'clock and we left like an hour later they had to go over like everything with me like how to set my phone so my car can actually park itself but i don't really trust those things but that's like a cool feature to know about anyways i'm trying to check if my part's good and look look at that it's showing me Elijah wants to give you guys a quick show. He wants to get a car too, so go check out his OnlyFans. You know, everyone keeps asking me, what do you do for a living? And I always reply that you're a male stripper and like some people actually legit. Are you serious? Yeah, you I actually keep doing it. Yeah, I know I'm still doing that. Other than that, guys, that is pretty much it for today's video. This is the car that I got. And I just want to say thank you to everyone who has supported me. I wouldn't have been able to do this without you guys. So I'm very grateful. I feel really super blessed. My mom actually kissed me on the cheek today, guys, and said she's proud of me. I have a hard time expressing my emotions, but the best I can say is I'm very grateful for you guys, and I wish I can word that better and give like a long paragraph of how much I love you guys. <clears throat> See, look at that, I'm freaking out already just talking about this. I wish I could say that, but I'm so bad at words. You even got a lot of space back here. I know, we could do so much. Maybe I'll do like a car decorating accessory video. I thought you were about to say car giveaway. You wanna go drink our champagne?